Alright, welcome back to another Rig Review and today we're going to take a look at a lightsaber. This is for the new Anim Challenge and you can find this on this site. As always, I'm going to put the link in the description. It's fairly easy. Hit the download and you can see this here. Not allowed to use in any commercial work as always. And when you open up the rig in Maya, it's all fairly simple. This will be a fairly short review, but it has some really cool features. In general, you have the main controller that moves the whole thing around. Obviously, rotate, translate, all that good stuff. Inside here, you have another one just in case you have a different pivot point. Constrain this to something else, but it also has the light on off option here. So you can do this through that. And then in here you have a rotate, but I'm going to do something else here to show you what that is. So here you have a controller that lets you expand the length of it. You can also translate it around if you want to. Technically, you can also use this for the on off. But again, the button is here in case you want to do it like that. But the cool thing is you have two additional buttons here. If I get closer to this one here, one here. And if you do a translate move on this. Boing. Look at that. So you get a bit of a smear there. It's very cool. Gets into a pointy tip here. And then you can see actually what that rotate will do. So if you go onto this controller here, you have your rotate that changes it like that. Just in case you need to adjust it for a better visual silhouette or anything, you can also click here and do all of this. I mean, it's very, very flexible in that aspect. And that's kind of it. I mean, you got that left and right the smeary aspect you got this for the length of it this with the rotate that's all you can do here and that's just through this there's no translate nothing and here the inner con and the outer con depending on where you want to constrain this and that's about it there's nothing else to this it's not super detailed in terms of you know animating this little clip on or a button to push this so this is not meant to be super up close with those kind of details but it's cool to have a lightsaber and in terms of design it doesn't seem to be based on anything although there i say this bottom part reminds me of the darth vader lightsaber but there is a piece missing technically so this and this is a bit more darth vadery and the rest is not nerd but that's it very very cool and as always, all the goodies are in the description. You can see the download links to the direct site or for the animation buffet site where it is posted as well. But that's it from me. Have fun with this lightsaber.